All right, what is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Uh, I recently went to the Discraft factory warehouse and I picked up some discs, so I thought it'd be fun to kind of take you guys along with me and uh, see how some of them fly. I also got a box uh, from OTB and I'll show what, what, what I got now too. So starting off with the Visor Gang Visors. These are in stock now. These are the new gold and uh, navy ones. So these look pretty sick. I got a couple of sick t-shirts too. And I got my very own wheel sack. Oh, also a quick shout out to uh, Aquaman Middle School, which is where we all got a fan. School field before. Is it bad that I zoomed? So we'll see. No, it's fine. <laughs> and also thank you to Tristan Tanner for uh, man in the camera behind the camera. All right, and some OTB minis, which I guess are in stock now too. Finally, so check those out. Um, but yeah, so the I got a few Missy Challenger SSs. These things have been a staple in my bag for a while now, so definitely check these out. And I got a Nuco S. So let's see how these fly first, and then we'll get into the Dishcraft box. Missy Challenger SS. Honestly, it's the it's the SS version of the Challenger, but as you can see, it's still pretty stable. Um, we have a little bit of tailwind too, so keep that in mind. But now Nuco S, kind of domey too, so see how see how beaky these are. So not super beefy. Let's try one more for a Nuco S that flew like. Kind of like a good oval stable nuke, really, but this one's a little bit flat also. Let's see if it flies differently. Decently beefy. All right. I'm not going to show you everything in here because I basically got a bunch of nukes and a bunch of forces and a bunch of other stuff. So I'll just throw a few of, of like the nukes and forces and then some of the other stuff as well. First thing I got. Crystal Luna. Uh, I actually threw one of these, a red one, at Vegas a lot, and then kind of took it out of the bag since it got beat up. So I'm hoping this is kind of stable, and it might make its way into my bag. It goes so far. It's, it's basically a mid range, honestly, but. Um, yeah, I can see that making the bag. I've got my challenge, the, the Challenger SS's that I like, but if I want a little bit more distance, I could see, you know, wanting to use that uh, Luna. But also got some soles. Let's see how these fly. So good. See, I never have to worry about this thing fading out. It's just going to tone and hold that forever. Got, got one more of these. Such a good woods disc too. Use that a lot. Use that a decent amount at uh, Ogden for wolves actually. Got a couple of Dahl Quals, Brody Smith, uh, Crystal Meteors. So, see how these. I actually have an ESP Meteor in my bag now, so let's see how these fly. All the glide. So much glide. Got another one, pretty sick stamp here. It's like a wintertime sunset kind of thing. Or like a moonset. It's like a wintertime moonset, I think. So yeah. Well done, Brody Smith. Good disc. It's also like 95 degrees outside. And I feel like my face is melting. It's so hot. Uh, so we got a couple of impacts, Ledstone editions. 2OZ, but it's like more like 2 ESP. Honestly, it kind of flies, it flies like a six speed medial. It's like slightly faster, but very similar shape. Let's try one more. Maybe a touch more overstable. 
Solid disc though. That goes so far. Probably, probably won't, yeah, exactly. It's like, a, it's a mid-range, but it's, it's definitely higher speed than like a normal mid. Probably won't make it in my bag just because it's a kind of a wild diameter and I have a different disc in my bag for that slot. Then let's see, we've got a couple of flosses, I think. Um, Z, let's see how beefy this is. Oh, nah. Well, kind of beefy. Good finish. A little bit of flip up. Uh, let's see if we got a couple of ESP ones now. Super domey. So let's see if we can get some distance out of this boy. Oh, I'm more almost able to. That's actually really good. That's, that's more like what I look for in a fall, so I want to just kind of be consistently almost able to go play. So I want more sales with life. Nice. Yeah, so like a touch of flip. Pretty solid. Oh, I got a bunch of nukes now. So let's just see how these fly. I've got a purple one that's pretty domey, nice and stiff. Let's see how this flies. Oh my gosh, well. We'll edit that out. That came out, that was so bad. I threw it horribly and then it just boned over. Uh, this is like a maroon one. Super domey, pop top, stiff. A lot of distance, kind of, kind of unstable. Another one that's super pop toppy, orange one. We'll see how this one flies. Whoa, that held up though. A little bit of flip up, not bad. I right, got, got one more of these Z ones. This one's a little bit flatter too, so let's see if that changes the flight. That was definitely the most oval stable of the bunch. Maybe the blue ones are more beefy. I don't know. I like that one though. All right. Push this, this one now we got some of these. I don't know who this is, but he got his name on a nuke, so I'm gonna throw these. These are in the two L series plastic. Kills with flies. That was, that was definitely more oval stable than the, than the stock Z run, so that's definitely what I look for on these. Got another one, misprint X out. I think these are all max weight too, more close. Oh, that one's beefy. That one's really good. That one's nice. I could definitely see that one going in the old bag at some point. I really like my oval stable nukes, so consistent. This is like a sick blue color. Nice stamp. See if this matches that other one. Oh my gosh. It's literally like, those are, those are like perfect. It's like exactly what I want in a nuke. And then we got one more. Yellow guy. Little flip here off. Also really low. All right. I don't know if you can see the sweat, but I'm literally dripping in sweat right now. So this is the cardio that I get. Last but not least, maybe least since it's the smallest, Dark Quals Mini Buds. All right. I haven't thrown a mini disc in a long time, so hopefully my form doesn't go to crap and I injure myself, but we will see. I mean, not bad. I didn't, if I would've put that on a hyzer, it would've been perfect. I followed it too. You did? Nice. Um, well, that is it. Uh, let us know in the comments if you guys wanna see Tristan and I have a mini disc golf battle. I think Latitude has, a, or yeah. Dynamic has a couple of mini discs. Yep. 
I know we have a mini nuke and a mini buzz, so I think that'd be fun. Um, but that's pretty tiring. It's so hot. I need shade. I need water. I need AC. Um, but yeah, if you guys want to try any of those discs out, definitely go to dishcap.com or otbdiscs.com or your local retail and pick some of those out. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching. Make sure you follow Tristan's uh, socials and my socials. I'll have them all in the description. And we will see you guys in the next video. Thanks. And we will see you guys in the next video. Thanks. Wow.